What's up, keepers, and welcome back to a very special episode of our ARS Gloveman special. And this one is very unique because, yes, we are live streaming this video, which means I'm watching you guys through the webcam and I will be jumping on after this. But this is a pre recorded and pre set up video where we're going to be talking about our first impressions of the all new Roish Attract. Free Gel Fusion Goliator or Goliator uh, Goalkeeper Gloves. All you have to do to get your entry into the giveaway is follow ARS Goalkeeping and Royce Goalkeeping on Instagram and YouTube. You got to turn on those notifications and leave a glove miss comment or a comment about these gloves down below. So let's dive right into the features of these bad boys. The Goliators have been made under pro goalkeeper Wojciech Szczesny's guidance and is one of the many top of the line goalkeeper gloves Royce has dropped this December. The Goliators come in a modernized evolution negative cut, which seems like a lot flatter in the middle and ring finger than your typical negative cut style. The tips of the fingers have a full roll of latex for more grip on the ball, and on the palm, Royce has gone with an all new fusion technology that mixes a wet weather latex style with its durability increasing black dots for a mix of both worlds that has been embossed onto the palm to best fit your hand in its most natural state. Especially when it comes to closing the hands, these pre-cut lines into the palm resemble the creases on our hands and work pretty much the same. This also keeps the latex from tearing as quickly as the latex is embossed and it doesn't have that one solid type that can easily rip and go across the whole palm. I do really like the abrasion zone that Roish added in. It gives this extra padding on the heel of the hand and adds a bit of weight that might help in holding and parrying nastier shots. And while the upper half of the glove is definitely a negative cut style, it seems like the lower half of the palm actually more resembles a flat cut style, making the fit one that I really haven't used before. And while the durability is definitely going to be improved because of this embossed latex on the palm, the overall stickiness of the glove is not the highest. Embossing the latex means that you're taking a little bit of that stickiness to give you more durability and for a closer fit to the hand. And you can see it here out of our many tests that we do when we first get the gloves. Out of the bag, our grip test has a decent showing. These gloves handle and hold onto our ARS ball all the way from the ground up, which is a solid pass in our book. But I do have a little bit of fear with the dirt and mud on grass field. I do still remember how poorly my last Roish Latex worked on the grass fields and how great they were on turf. So I am definitely keeping my eye out for that wet weather and that mud performance. It's something that we have a lot when we're working on grass fields. And we've also got to talk about one of the biggest changes on these gloves, the all new backhand, which you can see is happening across the whole glove market. These neoprene backhands and neoprene wrist inserts that go down into the wrist area are getting much more popular and for good reason. While this doesn't have a neoprene insert, it has the typical uh, glove insert that you can see in a lot of older style gloves. It goes a lot farther down your wrist and it does mix in on the backhand with that neoprene. This neoprene material is soft and comfortable. It easily stretches and closes and it can fit any hand. It can fit almost any hand and it keeps the glove uh, in shape while staying lightweight. So I'm not surprised Royce added this feature onto their new models and I have to say the fit of the backhand with the new Royce extended wrist strap is superb. I absolutely love this new attract backhand style and wrist strap across all of their new glove line. So that's it for our first impressions. We're gonna finish up our full infield review soon. So while we wait for the gloves to be properly reviewed, let's have some fun. It's giveaway time, so let's get right into it and jump into the live giveaway. Thank you guys so much for coming and make sure to come back soon. So guys, in this round, we're dealing with a volley out the back. Let's say it's a clearance from the back or a cross out the, uh, the side of the goal, maybe a corner. And then I want to step up 
once he touches that ball and I read that he's gonna shoot it on his first touch, I gotta drop back to my line, get into the best angle. So let's see if we can do it in the right time. Good save. Mm-hmm. 